God bless that man, fire and ice. Um, the torches cast a shadow. The torches glow. You ever wonder how when you light a match or hold a flame up to a wall or in the dark and it has no reflection as in it has no ca it casts no shadow? You ever wonder about that? It almost makes me and reminds me of how, you know, how someone can have the Holy Spirit and it's just like, anyway, I'll put it like this, the, in the physical realm, without spiritual eyes, like, we can't see that fire burning, we can't see that fire casting its shadow, but if you put on your spiritual eyes and take off the veil off your eyes, you will see that there's a glow, that there is a shadow, that there is a covering there that the people who just live in this physical realm, um, they, they can't, obviously they can't, uh, see it, but the people who have spiritual eyes, they can see it, it does, it does show to them. It does reveal to them what is happening, what is taking place, you know? And so... It's just something I, I've seen and I've noticed it for a while. And then it's just like, the Spirit's told me and it said that... My Spirit does the same thing, it's just... My torch, my fire, my light glows, it's just a matter of... Who's looking at it? Who's the witness? Is it people would still with the veil of their eyes? Are they witnessing? Because they can't see my glow. But the people who have that have eyes to see can see the glow. They can see the shadow being cast by the torch, by the flame. Like the flame in the dark at the wall. You can see a reflection because that's his spirit. But only spiritual minded people with eyes to see can see that torch casting its shadow. That flame casting its shadow. That spirit. His spirit casting shadow. The reflection. You know? It's there. You just have to be able to see it. You know? And that's a good example to, uh, to give to somebody who, uh, who don't have, who, uh, who has a veil over their eyes, it's something good to give to them. It's something great, actually, to give to them. It's just a matter of time for them. They have to be able to see it, you know? It's about them. They have to be able to go, and they have to be able to actually see it. You know? So... I mean, that's just something that's been speaking to me, and I've seen it, I've been seeing it for a while. It's just, uh, you know, it really spoke to me hard today, so, you know. No pun intended, but yeah, that's, that's something I really hold and keep in mind, too, as well. So, no doubt about it. God bless, amen, fire and ice, God speak.